Hey guys, this is Dr. Subhav Ramnani and welcome back to the channel. And here's a day in my life in 323 seconds. Let's go. So by recently passing the foreign medical graduate exam or the FMG has made me eligible to apply for internship here in Delhi, India. So we are required to do internship for the whole year that means 365 days and in various departments. So today's agenda is to go to two hospitals and inquire about these internship opportunities. So let's see how it goes. So first I'll be going to BL Kapoor Hospital which is a bit far from my place so I am taking the metro to reach there and apparently the metro station is right in front of the hospital so if I plan to get internship there and if I actually get internship there it is a major convenience. Now you know it's game time when you have to switch your backpack from your back to your front. From Rajiv Chowk metro station, I changed the line to go to Rajendra Place metro station where I meet my friend Manik and we both will be applying together to get an internship at BL Kapoor Hospital. Well, we are not applying now, we are just going to inquire about it and let's see what happens. So we went to the HR or the administration department at the hospital and sadly they said there are no vacancies till the foreseeable future I guess. So we went on to another hospital, Gangaram hospital which is near BLK and again we got the same result that there are no vacancies right now and a letter will be posted about the vacancies so we have to wait. So one reason that there are no vacancies in any hospital in Delhi is that everyone from India wants to do internship in Delhi because number one, the government hospitals in Delhi don't charge a fee or charge a very nominal fee and even the private hospitals in Delhi charge a very nominal fee compared to other hospitals elsewhere in India. So after eating lunch while watching office, a new package has arrived and I'm going to unbox or set it right in front of you. So after a hectic day outside in the sun and also setting up that machine, I still have to study. And I have a meeting or a one-on-one -on -one guided session tonight for which I'll prepare some notes and then go and fire away and do my Anki. After completing Anki, the new topic for today which I have to do is General Pathology which I'll be doing from Pathoma. So recently I've started offering one-on-one -on -one guidance sessions to my juniors, improving their study plan or creating a personalized study plan for their entrance exams like FMG, USMLE or just for their med school in order to improve their study techniques and improve their efficiency in studying. And you can book a one-on-one -on -one session with me by clicking the link in the description below. Just 
like that, a productive and hectic day in my life is complete. And if you like this short day in my life video, then don't forget to click the like button and also the subscribe button to see more content like this. Good night. Thank you.